climb up the world tree to the top? Very, very tiring. It doesn't look that far from here to the surface, at least. We can manage that, surely. Don't you ever quit with that optimism, huh? <laughs> Rex, I can see why you've brought Jin, but I advise you not to let your guard down. Morag? Got a point. I don't need your remorse now, Jin. But when we're past this crisis, I'm taking you in. I owe it to my leader and to my people. If you resist, we'll kill you. Bridget and I. Yes. Morag! What? Another monster? What is it this time? Master Pun! A valve! That's Jim. What's he doing with them? Weird. Let's ask questions later, huh? After we finally smashed huh? him up. Seriously? Well, okay. Hmm. Jen? Yes. Don't attack, he says. What? But it's the perfect chance. Huh. I told you not to attack! <laughs> you sly devil. Hid that one up your sleeve, didn't you? No idea why he said that, but he must have his reasons. Huh? You can't be too predictable, right? Mick? Sounds like a plan. Never seen that side of Jin before. Let's bring him up. Then it's world tree climbing time. Yes, sir. Bridget. Huh? You're still... Like you used to be. Jim. Damn! Ursuls. That's a bit unsporting of them, using a giant boat. We must hurry. The longer we wait, the bigger their advantage. Yeah, we gotta go, Rex. Gramps, you knew, right? About Jin. Indeed. Why didn't you tell me? He is not like Malos. To be honest, I didn't know if you could handle it. You care too much at times. Hmm. Jin and Malos must be defeated. Who knows how that'll turn out. But facing them is Pyra and Mithra's unavoidable fate. So I kept quiet. Pyra and Mithra's fate? She shoulders the burden of sustaining your life. Rex, what burden are you taking for her? Can you live for something and hold true to it? Yeah, of course. I'm living for them. Pyra and Mithra. I see. Well, I guess you're okay then. Just be sure to walk your own path, Rex. Believe in yourself. Rex! Old man, what are you doing? Huh? Old man? Sorry, wait up! <laughs> <laughs>